Hey guys, I'm out here at the No Frills, and I'm going to see how much $20 will give me. So I'm looking for how much bang for my buck I can get. So I'm going to see how, how much stuff I can get. Hey guys, just got back from my grocery shop. I'm going to show you how I spent my $20. So the first item I got is always the trickiest. I, it's the meat. So I picked up some honey garlic sausages for five dollars they're on sale the next item i got was some chicken stock picked it up for a dollar then i also got some enoshi picked this up for two dollars so far i'm at about eight dollars right now the next thing i got was some romaine lettuce um, got this for two dollars for two heads. The next thing I got was uh, some mushrooms. Uh, I picked this up for one dollar. The next thing, which is usually on sale, I picked it up also for a dollar, is some chickpeas. I love chickpeas, you make some a nice hummus or uh, you can also make some roasted chickpeas. I thought that was a good pickup. Next item I picked up is one large sweet potato. So now I'm right around $13, so I'm not quite at 20 and I still have some room to go. So uh, I picked up some grape tomatoes. Pick this up for a dollar. Then the next thing I picked up was a red onion. Make a, a salsa with the tomatoes with that. And then the next item I got was some uh, tortillas that I got on sale for also a dollar. So now I have options. I can I can make a mushroom and sausage inoshi with uh, basic ingredients I have at home to make, to make a sauce. Um, I can do a fully loaded big potato with uh, homemade salsa that's left over. Um, I can do a mushroom soup with the mushrooms and the chicken stock. So overall I, I spent $18.50 so I have a dollar and 50 cents left for change. So I could have ran back and, and grabbed something else but I decided not to because I just wanted to get in and out right now. So so overall, I, I think I got a pretty good haul here.